Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We have a banger of a video for you today. We got a real humdinger for you today. <laughs> if you saw a recent video of the truck or a Facebook post I put out, you know that uh, I just had it detailed and I had it color corrected uh, on top of the detail. So incredible transformation. And we thought it'd be fun to uh, invite Jeff from Top Star Mobile Detailing out to detail my mom's lovely forerunner uh, beautifully in the worst shape possible so he can bring out the biggest transformation possible and just kind of show you what he does how he does it and hopefully inspire you to take advantage of his services because we're convinced he's the best in town and he's certainly delivered on on our truck hope you enjoy the video and let's get started he's on his way right now Good morning. How are you? Good. Good to see you. All right. So nice. this is Jeff with Top Star Auto Detailing. I would call it Vegas's best mobile detailer. Would you agree or no? I would agree with that. Okay. Yeah. Right on. So we're just going to take my mother's forerunner and try to make it look like new again. You think it's doable? For sure. We can get that cleaned up just like brand new. We'll kind of talk through some of the, the more challenging parts of the detail and then just show you how he does his thing. I think it's pretty cool because he took my truck and made it look 20 years newer and uh, just incredible transformation. So can't wait for you guys to see it. I'm assuming this is kind of your first step is to just kind of go around and look inside and outside. and. Yeah, it. I kind of like to go through the vehicle with the owner and just see if there's any specific um, areas of attention they want, you know, stains or anything like that inside, or maybe a scratch outside or some tar or something, mm -hmm. sap that maybe is, is on the car. So we just kind of do like a little perimeter sweep through the vehicle and, yep. and address any concerns. Um, normally if there's like a lot of pet hair or something, we might address that just to see, but here it doesn't look like we have too much. Actually looks like it's in pretty decent shape. Just needs a little refresh. Check yeah, there's the a giant here. Rottweiler named Boone that likes to hang out in this rig every once in a while, but yeah, we'll see what kind of mark he left. Well, it looks like he doesn't shed too much, so minimal pet hair, so not too bad there. This has the third row seating, I believe. Mm -hmm. So is that uh, a little bit more of a challenge um, as far as like getting all in? Not really more of a challenge, just a little bit more time involved with it. Uh, the bigger the vehicle, the longer it's going to take. In much better shape than the majority of the vehicles that I really see some really disaster details. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So where would this fall in the lineup of like on a scale of one to ten? Yeah. Maybe a three three or four. Okay, not yeah. bad at all. So it looks like we've been on a road trip. Um, yeah, so a little bit of backstory. This vehicle spent the summer in Alaska, which is infested with bird sized mosquitoes. Yeah, so that's what you're looking at. There is just a, a few trips in and out of town, which I look at this mm -hmm. and I go, how is that ever going to come off? I've actually tried to remove bugs from our vehicles in Alaska before and it took hours. Yeah. So, uh, can't wait to see you do something with that. Yeah, it's really just about having the right products and the right tools for the job. Mm -hmm. um, and we have that all in the mobile unit over there. So tell us about the trailer. Did you buy the trailer new or used? And then So I bought the trailer uh, brand new and it was brand just new. completely a shell Ooh. with nothing in it. Okay. Didn't have the diamond plating, obviously didn't have the wrap on there. And I had kind of a blueprint in my mind of what I wanted for the inside. I just needed somebody to help me actually build it out so I had a company in uh, West Covina California called H2O uh, Auto Detail Supply mm. and they pretty much built it out for me the way that I that I wanted it and just kind of told them what I wanted inside and and uh, they do a great job there's not really anywhere here in Vegas that I could find that does anything like that did they uh, provide the equipment at all the compressor the pressure that's where I bought everything through them too yep okay. so I actually bought all the equipment all the products through them um, they're great down there as far as customer service goes and uh, huh. and very knowledgeable about you know getting you set up to get started you had to make three stops you went and got the trailer you went to California and they 
filled out the inside and then you went to get it wrapped and then I actually had it wrapped before I even brought it out there okay. yeah so um, I had that done that was the first thing that I wanted to do was get it wrapped because it's marketing it's like yeah, mobile it marketing having a driving around a billboard basically you know so let's swing this open here Wow I would say this inspires a lot of confidence in the customer whether they know it or not Yeah, when people see you know how organized everything is how it's set up it just kind of shows them that you're serious about the business and uh, how you take care of your stuff is probably how you're gonna take care of their vehicle as well Ooh, I like that yeah so one of the cool features about this is it has a slide out generator so that's designed to where that can slide out so your exhaust doesn't fill up your trailer it kind of keeps that out separate from here so the way my system set up it has a hundred gallon water tank um, and it's designed to make its own deionized spot free water so it has a bypass system where you can open or close these valves um, and that will determine whether it's just using tap water or spot free water here in Vegas we have really hard water so if you don't use some type of deionized water uh, spot free water you're going to end up with spots water spots all over the vehicle at the end you know you could do it like that but you're just making more work for yourself These are two very important tools if there's pet here. So um, you got the brush by Lily, and this one is the Uproot Clean. But these are must-haves. If there's a lot of pet here, this will make your job so much easier. So before we switch to the exterior, yep. is this your first time starting your own business? It's not my first time. Um, I actually started a jet ski rental business when I was 19 in Florida. Um, so I do have some like business background. I did that for like a few years and probably others, a couple other small businesses. I did detailing back then as well. It just wasn't at, at the level that I'm uh, doing at now. I'm assuming you have to remove all personal items out of a vehicle before you start in on it. It's the weirdest thing you ever found. <laughs> bullets? I don't know. I found loose bullets okay. in the car one time. Like America. Just random different bullets under the seat and stuff, you know? I'm okay and, with that. And yeah, so I was like, yeah, you probably want to pick these up, make sure none of them go <laughs> off while well, I'm... Um, vacuuming or cleaning or something you know a typical job is what three four five hours what depending, do you do if you have to go to the bathroom okay yeah depending i see where you're going with that now <laughs> i thought you were asking me more about the different no, jobs we don't care about that yeah um as far as bathroom breaks go i never really asked the client to use their bathroom uh so you just kind of come prepared you know my trailer you can go inside close the door and uh, you know, maybe keep a Gatorade bottle or something like that in there to, to get you through if you need to, <laughs> you know.
might be wondering why I'm talking into a spatula right now. Uh, we're learning during this sort of longer form shoot that we're doing that we're, we have gear that is malfunctioning and one of our mics went out and we're working with like two SD cards between three cameras. And so, yeah, we have some gear issues and now I'm talking into a spatula. I'm going to take a break from spending money on the truck. And when I say I'm going to take a break, I'm going to just keep buying stuff. But Crystal is going to start buying stuff for her hobby, which is making videos. And I fully support it because she's amazing and deserves the best of the best of everything. The other thing, too, is we're, we flew a drone at, earlier, and it's from, it's from like 2018. So we're talking ancient, highly antiquated equipment that needs to be replaced. And the biggest benefit to some of the newer drones is you don't have to use your phone which is a huge pain the controller has a screen on it and everything right there so it's just turn it on and go which is pretty cool Got her done. Just barely before it gets dark. Yeah. The happy hour starts. Uh, I have a new appreciation for how much work it takes to get a vehicle looking this good. The value is incredible in my mind. And uh, so, excellent work. Thanks. Before we leave everyone with some super satisfying B roll of the before and after stuff, uh, why don't you tell everyone? Maybe the cheapest and most expensive thing you offer and yes, where they can find you. It ranges um, for full detail on smaller vehicles. It starts off around 180 and uh, ranges up into the 400 range for larger vehicles, uh, large SUVs, lifted trucks, things like that for the full detail. Um, all the pricing and packages can be found on the website, topstardetailing.com. That has everything on there. Uh, or check out the Instagram is Top Star Detailing as well. Bug just flew into my eye. <laughs> that's, that's life. Yeah. And so a couple things I want to highlight real quick is the sort of subscri sub subscription-based maintenance thing that he does. You get a pretty good discount if you just sign up for regular sort of monthly. Once you become a client, yeah. So it's not for first-time clients. You have to be an existing client already. Mm -hmm. uh, but once you get your first detail, if you're interested in doing a maintenance program, um, it's just basically bi-weekly or at least once a month, then that qualifies you for 50% off your detail. So it's basically half price as long as you're getting service once within a month. Um, so we have a lot of clients that opt for that and just go on a monthly program. And then the last thing I'll highlight is the color correction service that you offer. If you have an older vehicle that just looks old, chances are a color correction could do wonders for it. It did for my truck, and so look into that. But thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. I it's been a pleasure. Uh, check out Jeff and Top Star Mobile Detailing. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon. <laughs>